All right, the x-intercept. Okay, please write x-intercept. The symbol that we have for this one is a heart for Valentine's Day. Okay, mm -hmm. the nickname for this one has a lot. Are you okay? It's the zero. Is a root. Those are the different names you might see on the test. Okay, what line is this one on? Thank you. <laughs> That's the horizontal. Okay, it's on the uh, horizontal. And for this one, when you see a table, which one is the one that's zero, X or Y? Y. It's the opposite that's a zero. Always. <laughs> no, he didn't. Did he really? All right, that's the y, that's the x-intercept. X-intercept is on the, on which one? The horizontal, the, yeah, the x-axis, the y is zero. Always, always, always. So get out the one that's your example. Let's do number one. No, it'll record after. I can hear y'all, of course. Is that what you're asking? So. <laughs> All right. Here's the x-axis. There's your heart. Okay, go ahead and do number two, number three, number four. I'm going to walk around and check it. Do number two, number three, number four. Draw the hearts. Ready? Everyone has the hearts? Heart there. Heart there. Heart there. Okay, for number three, I'm going to have you write the point. So which one is always equal to zero? Cesar, do you remember? Which one? Perfect. What's the X here, um, Christian? What's the X? Negative four. Because it's on that side. All right, the other one here for the, um, which one is equal to Y, Ali, Zubi? Which one, X or Y? Perfect. Y is always zero for the x-intercept. What's the? Where's the heart here, Abigail? Thank you, too. 